Hello clean freaks and germaphobes. Welcome to our channel. And today I'm talking about a microwave cleaner called the Angry Mama. It comes in this simple package. This is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. When I saw it in pictures and other YouTube channels, I was thinking it was like half the size. You take off the hair part. If you don't have vinegar, you could use lemon juice. It's a quarter cup water, a quarter cup of vinegar, if you were curious. You put it into your microwave for seven minutes and then you don't open the door, okay? Don't let the steam out. Let it just sit there for two minutes. I'll put a link to Angry Mama Andy's in the video description if you wanna check those out. She has her arms cause she's mad. They're on her hips and she's like, stop making a mess. But it also is a convenient way to hold it and it's heat resistant so it's not gonna burn your hand. You can put the same ingredients inside of a, a glass bowl not a metal bowl <laughs> and you can do it that way but you're gonna have to use hot pads because it'll burn you i'm gonna show you a demo and this is from my friend marissa she actually did this on her microwave and she gracefully volunteered to let me show you this is how dirty it is angry mama do your thing So that is just wiping it with this terry cloth cleaning rag. This is not coming off just with a rag. We're gonna have to like soak that or something. Okay, now I've gotten this rag wet, rinsed it out and got it wet and I'm trying to wipe off the rest of this just with some water. It's definitely looking better than before we did the microwave Angry Mama, but I think I'm gonna have to do it again to get the rest of this off. Here's the door. So there's the door after I wiped it off. It's looking much better. There still is some residue on the door and inside here. Um, this is a kind of an older microwave, so there's some there's been some fun happening in here from kids. As you can see, I'm gonna put Angry Mama back in here. We're gonna do it for another seven minutes and see if that gets it the rest of the way clean. Okay, so this is the first rag that I used. You can see there's kind of grease on it. I mean, it wasn't totally clean, but like it was stained before, but this brown stuff is grease from the microwave. And so it's, it's looking kind of gross. So I am actually gonna use this one this time. This is a microfiber cleaning rag, okay? So we're gonna open the microwave because it's been seven minutes plus the two minutes that it needed to just stand there and marinate so as you can see there's some droplets of vinegar and water so we're just gonna start wiping this up and see if it will come drips on the top. This side's probably going to need a little extra soap and water or something like that because there's those spots that don't want to come off. Some of these spots are burn marks from people putting things in here that shouldn't be in here. And done. Angry Mama worked awesome. Just used the rag and wiped it off under the warm water in the sink. All clean.
So I think Marissa did a great job and Angry Mama did a good job. So it's not perfect, right? But she did it twice. It was a pretty big mess. It wasn't like a faked mess. It was real caked on food that had been there for a while. And so, you know, I think that's great. I think it would be really good for a college kid because, you know, they might do it more. Some in two packs and you notice that the second Angry Mama, she has a purple dress on this time. She's also really mad. <laughs> and then you can get the green with purple hair. So anyway, they kind of remind me of like, what are those called? Those little toys little people. when you're kids. I'm going to show you little people. I don't know about you guys, but I had these like little people when I was little. Maybe I have to put antique now. Yeah. Do you guys remember this stuff? Like these guys? She kind of reminds me of the angry version of them. Like look at the hair. <laughs> So it also, she also comes with purple hair and green, and then you can get the brown hair and yellow. This is my favorite. I don't know, even if, no matter how you feel about Trump, look how he has a USA tie on. And then this one, it's the erupting volcano. I think the Trump ones that makes the best gag gift of all, especially, oh, make your microwave clean again. You can't buy it, dang it, but there you go. He has his own hat too. And they actually say that it cuts cleaning time in half. And so just to sum up, I mean, it's cute, it's fun, and it cuts your cleaning time in half. You don't have to measure anything. You're not gonna burn yourself. I'm also really into prevention. Our family, what we do is we take a piece of paper towel, wet it down to like that much, put it over our food, and that's what keeps the spotters under control. The next way is if you can't avoid it, because like if I make macaroni in the microwave, which I do a lot, sometimes it boils over. You can just, did you know you can cook pasta in the microwave and it's like super life-changing and fast, but you have to have a really big glass bowl. Otherwise it's gonna boil over and you'll have pasta juice all over in the bottom of your microwave. So the next tip is just clean it up right away. Cause if it dries on there, then it's like a scrubbing job. And you know, I hate to have to do scrubbing. I, I'd rather just, wipe things out fast, but you know, real life, right? So, and I'm still battling other battles, but we've got the microwave covered. It's always really clean and that's how I like it too. Have you tried the Angry Mama yourself? Let me know in the comments and would you ever buy one? And if you know anyone who needs this or will think it's fun, please just share this video with them. And if you wanna watch another cleaning video, I would highly recommend that you check out my video on the best way to clean an oven because ovens are a big messy job that I hate to do. And yet I find myself doing it way too much, but I did a bunch of tests on different ovens that were really, really dirty and I found the best way. And so I'm gonna put a link to that video so you will know too, and it'll hopefully save you a lot of time and effort. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in that next video. You can do it yourself. You can simp, and you can do this one. <sighs> Kitty, you're distracting me. Kitty, get down. You can do it that way, but you're gonna have to use hot pads. Daddy. Get down, oh my gosh. Get down, get down, get down.